Shalom. I'll first off by giving all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh, Bashim Yahushai, Bashim Rakhadash, Rakhati Yahweh, Rakhati Yahushai, Bashim Rakhadash. The honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone and rule well. Peace, blessings, and salutations to the hopeful elect. Um, I'm on the road right now, and I was just meditating upon the scriptures. Lord willing, you know, I can uh, articulate those thoughts, and that it might be edifying onto the listeners. Um, but pretty much, um, you know, I'm thinking about the things that we do in this world. The scriptures say, um, be users of the world, but not abusers of it. You know, because we're actually in this world. You know, we have to use it. Like, we have to, you know, work a job. Like, we have jobs we have to work. Or we have family members we might have to deal with. Our woman, that's worldly, we have to deal with. All right, but we can't be abusers of it. We can't get caught up in it. All right, because you're going to be destroyed. Like it says in Micah 2 and 10, Arise, ye depart, this is not your rest. It is polluted, it will destroy you with the sword of destruction because if you're actually caught up into this world and, and believe in this, in this world and its philosophies and its ways, you are, you're going to be destroyed. You're going to be destroyed when the Lord calls and He brings His wrath upon this earth to destroy the children of disobedience, all right? The way of this world is disobedient to the ways of the Heavenly Father, all right? So if you're uh, in one accord with this world, when the Heavenly Father comes to destroy it or recompense it, recompense means to pay back, pay back this world for its wickedness, you're going to be part, you're going to be partakers of that. All right. And us hopeful elect, those that are calling upon the name of the Lord in sincerity and truth. All right. And that's going out week in and week out to preach the word. We're hoping that the Lord has mercy upon us that we be not partakers of death, of the second death that's coming. All right. That burneth with fire. Uh, and brimstone okay we're hoping that we're partakers of the salvation promised to the, to the holy prophet since the world began all right that's our hope okay but Yahweh shy he prayed for the elect in John the 17th chapter all right he said they are not of the world but those that the, the, that the Lord has given that was given to him the elect they're not of the world even as he was not of this world all right so we're not of this world okay but the lord said what i pray that thou shouldest not take them out of this world but that thou shouldest keep them from the evil because we're in this world okay we're in this world why just like apostle paul said he said to gain uh to die is gain but to live is hamashiach meaning he'd rather be dead you know, but him living was to what? Preach the word, preach the gospel. Us that um, that are go out there week in and week out to preach the word, we hate our lives unto the death. Like it says in Revelation, they hate they hate their lives unto the death. We hate our lives unto death. All right, but we know that we gotta preach the word. Okay, we're dead in Yahweh Shai. All right, we're dead in Yahweh Shai, so that when Yahweh Shai comes back and returns to the earth and reigns, we shall live also with them. You know? So yeah, this is just a little rant. Real world is edifying. Call Allah, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bashim Rakhadash, that will honor the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone to rule well, for their sauce is true. Peace, blessings, and salutations to the hopeful elect, the sincere Akim. All right? And aquas out there that actually believe on this word, which is going to lead on to immortality, eternal life. Shalom.